Across the world, a republic of beer is famous for brewing, but glassmaking also has a rich tradition and history here. Both are crafts perfected over centuries, skills passed down through generations. And at Budweiser Budvar, we've brought them together, creating a new glass for our beer. The creation of our glass was an important moment. As well as looking great, the glass had to be the perfect shape, weight and size, to showcase the aromas and flavors of our beer. Every beer tastes different, and every beer, I think, wants to be presented differently, and different glasses can really help that. You know, if we have a German-style lager, you kind of want it to be tall and thin. The bubbles are gonna come up, stream up into a nice foam on top, and it's gonna enhance the bitterness of it. But that's not really what you want with the Czech-style beer. You want this big, round, bellied glass where you can swirl the beer around into it, it's gonna hold onto the foam, and it's gonna enhance that kind of that softness of the malt character. So finding the right artist and product designer for our glass was a big decision. Like our beer, we knew that our glass needed to embody and tell the story of a nation. Fortunately here, in the Republic of Beer, when it comes to the art of glassmaking, we have some of the best in the world. Glass is a magic material. The glass doesn't have fixed crystal structure, it's still in motion. I started working with glass when I was 15. Now it will be more than 40 years. I have long, long experience with glass, especially with cutting glass. I like uh, companies with, with long history. It's the same with Boudoir. Design is not only about personality of, of artist. Good design must have two parts. Must be beautiful, but must be functional too. When I designed uh, glass for Boudoir, my biggest inspiration was uh, paintings of Josef Lada, favorite painter of Pablo Picasso. I found it on his pictures, some details of Max, and I designed this shape for Boudoir with this inspiration. It's important to make pieces with historical connections. Boudoir has a long tradition, and Czech cutting glass has a long tradition too. I hope when you drink beer with Boudoir glass, you can see one fantastic part of Czech glass history. So why does this Czech mug work so well? Like one, it's the tradition. If you look at old images, you look at old brewery photos, this is what they drank from. Like they've been doing this for decades, it just works. You've got the handle, which also means you don't have to hold the glass. So then you don't need to warm your glass up with your hand, so you can hold it. And it's also practical for the server. If you're over at a table with some friends, they can bring over a couple of glasses at the same time and put them down. Again, it's that practical element, but it's also very good for the drinker because it enhances the flavor profile of the beer. If we go down into the cellar and we see this beer being drunk by the brewmaster, he is drinking out of a glass like this. This is how it works for him. This is what it's been designed specifically for. You get to see the beer. You get that foam, you can smell the beer properly, you can put your face inside that glass. You can really get that, that subtle but elegant aroma coming out from that glass. And then that drinkability that comes by having that big open wide mouth on it. This glass is designed to suit this beer. In this glass is everything. History, modern design and fantastic taste of beer. Azdraví.